Hi guys, welcome back to another video. So today I am finally getting you guys a video after three weeks of not giving you a video and I'm so sorry for that. It's literally been a crazy few weeks. We've been moving. I did have volleyball for two of those weeks. Um, and I had like practice like every single day and then I had like games. Uh, like I said, we've been moving. So for like a good two weeks we were doing a lot of moving and packing and being in the middle of houses where like I had Wi-Fi at one house but everything else at the other house so like stuff like that just it would have been really annoying to get a video out on one of the weeks because I would have had to record at my other house because that's where like everything was and then take the footage on a laptop or some sort and take it to the new house because where our Wi-Fi was so to edit and upload I would have like so it was just a big mess for three weeks I did not give you a video and I apologize but I am back now hopefully I'm good now and I can give you guys a, week, a video every week um we'll see about that but I hope I can um, so this is a video I've actually been wanting to do a lot recently and I thought it would be a really fun idea and it's a super easy video to just kind of show you guys and um, a lot of you guys ask for it too because of like the amount of posts I have on Instagram and stuff. Um, a lot of you guys ask for a shoe haul video or at least like my vans because I do have a good collection of vans at this point because I've, I've been the same size shoe since 8th grade. Yeah, since 8th grade and I'm a sophomore now so I've had the same size shoe so all of these shoes are like literally what I've collected over time since 8th grade. So it may seem like a lot, but it's literally because I've had them, I've gotten them over the course of two to three years. So yeah, I'm going to give you guys a little haul, basically just my Vans and my Crocs because I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight pairs of Vans and two pairs of Crocs because those are the two shoes I actually wear. And of course in my closet I have like a couple pairs of sandals and stuff, but like these are like my main shoes, so I thought it'd be fun to show you guys. So I'm going to go in order in like how old they are and like when I first got them till now. So you, you, I think you'll definitely be able to tell how the first ones are the older ones and how the um, more, the last ones I show you are going to be like the more newer ones. So um, we'll just start off with these two. So. On Christmas of 8th grade, I got these two pairs of shoes. Uh, they're a little beat up, as you can tell. Um, uh, especially the red ones, because the red ones I did wear very frequently. I feel like I wore them literally all the time. There actually is one pair of shoes I'm not including in this haul. Actually, no, I'll include them, just for the sake of literally I'm showing you all of my pairs of Vans. Um, so I will include them, so give me one second, I will be right back. Alright, I am back with the pair of shoes that I wasn't going to include originally because I don't wear them anymore because the literally because of the fact of how beat up they are which these were my camping shoes that's the only time I wore them but these are technically my first pair of Vans um, that I still own to this day and uh, I got these as my first day of school or like first yeah first day of school shoes for eighth grade so they are checkered slip-ons and they're pretty beat up um, the reason why they're this beat up is you can blame Reagan's dog I wore them to Reagan's house when she first got her puppy around when she got her first puppy like he was still pretty young and didn't know better and he still actually likes to chew on shoes but I left them in her living room without knowing that her dog ate shoes and he was eating my shoes so this is what they look like they're a little I don't know if it's focusing either way you could still see how beat up they are um, they're very dirty and yucky and they are very ripped up as you can see so he ripped up the strap here which is uh, makes them really loose now because like he broke the elastic that are on there. He broke the front right here and the back. So this one's not as bad. It just kind of got the back right there. But um, yeah, so these are technically my first pair of Vans that I still own to this day because these were my uh, camping shoes. So I kept them because they were already so beat up. Didn't matter if I wore them camping. Um, but yeah, I got these the first day of school, eighth grade. So yep, I wasn't included because of the fact that I don't wear them anymore. But I feel like it's fun to include them. So now we get to the red and gold ones that I was showing you before, and I got these Christmas of eighth grade, so just a couple months after. My parents gave me these gold ones on Christmas morning, and they're very cool, very unique. I don't wear them very often. Um, I don't know why, honestly. They're actually really cool. I don't know why I don't wear them so often. I think it's because I have so many other options that like I like more, so I wear those ones more often. Um, but yeah, these ones I got, so that's why they're not too bad. They're a little dirty, as you can tell, because they're lighter colored shoes. And of course, they're just going to be dirties on, dirty on the sides. But yeah, I got these 8th grade Christmas for my parents. Very cool. I think those are considered the old school style. And these look the exact same, but in red. Um, these ones are definitely a little beat up, and you could tell they're older, like compared to the shoes I'm going to show you as I show you um I don't really know what the camera picks up because these don't look too bad on camera but they're actually very dirty they've got a lot of scuff marks on them and the laces you could definitely tell are worn down they're just very like 
not as white and stuff but they're still they have no rips or anything on the outside literally none of my shoes i never have rips on the outside i start to get rips on the inside like on the soles sometimes in some of them but yeah i got these also on christmas for my grandparents so uh, thanks to them um i really like these shoes actually and you could just tell i wore them a lot because they are more beat up than some of my newer shoes but uh yeah red old school checkered and then next now these shoes are very beat up just because of the fact that i wore them i wear, basically wear them like i wore them every single day because they're all white so these are my all white slip-ons these have definitely gotten a little beat up and dirty um and these ones actually started to rip on their own we don't have to blame reagan's dog anymore um so yeah these ones have started to got get a uh, little little worn down on their own for simply because of the fact that they're white and i wore them every day because they're the shoes that match everything um so yeah they're a little dirty but uh now these have become the shoes that i wear whenever i know i'm doing something that i don't want to get my shoes dirty or um when i go camping and stuff these are my new shoes to wear or uh sometimes i wear them to volleyball like whenever i'm going but most of my different my crocs now i got these the summer before freshman year so yeah on our summer vacation i got them like right before then like on our two-week road trip we went on so they were like brand new and fresh and white for that trip um and then now obviously they're a little beat up but yeah so summer for eighth grade or, sorry summer for freshman years when i got these um okay and then on that two-week road trip when we were in reno we went to a little outdoor mall area and they had a vans outlet and i got these shoes for pretty cheap i don't remember how expensive they were but they were definitely cheaper than what they originally were and i saw them and i was just like these are so cool like i thought they were the coolest shoes ever like i just thought they were so unique and different and i haven't i hadn't had high tops before so i got these blue high tops and i actually really really like them um i think they're still super cool and stylish and I, like i said i feel like not a lot of people have the high tops or like not a lot of people wear them for style purposes like they just have them but like i think they're just like a cool like for certain outfits they just kind of add touch and i'm very much like a shoes person i like i very much appreciate shoes and i feel like shoes add so much to outfits and like really just put an outfit together some people are just like oh shoes are shoes i wear the same pair every day totally not nothing wrong with that of course it just for me like i think shoes are such a good like so whenever someone gets me shoes for christmas or my birthday i'm literally so pretty i'm just like oh my gosh thank you so much especially when they're like different colored bands and stuff uh, i just i love it so i saw these shoes and i was just like i really really like these my mom kept seeing me look at them she's like do you like them I was like yes and she's like well what's the price and like i said i don't remember how much they were but they're at the outlet store and they're like super cheap and then they had a sale to like buy one get one half off or something like that and so my dad wanted, needed a new pair of shoes like his were like done so he needed a new pair of shoes that my mom was like okay you can get these so i got these and i literally was in love with them i wore them like the rest of the trip on any outfits that they like matched with but yeah so i got these kind of the same the summer before freshman year on my trip when, like when we like i said when we went to the little outdoor mall and, like i said these ones are a little dirty too um like the bottoms for sure but i still wear them i actually wore these on my first day of school this year out of all the shoes i'm about to like i've showed you and i'm about to show you these are the ones I chose to wear just because they went with my outfit so well and I really like them. So, yep. Blue high tops. These are my only high top bands and I love them and I think they're really cool. And yeah, so blue high tops. And then these ones I got for my birthday last year, so freshman year when I turned 15. My parents got me these and I was super surprised. I was like, shoes for my birthday. Cause like to me, like, I don't know, to so some people these like may not, the bands may not be expensive. You're just like, $60, $70. Oh, that's not that bad for shoes. For me, I'm just like, I look at that price and I'm like, Oh my gosh like if someone gets me shoes i'm just like you did not have to do that like they're ex like to me that's expensive um so one of my parents got me shoes for my birthday which for christmas i'm like okay christmas i don't know to me i feel like birthdays are like not as special and it's like you just give me something little for my birthday or whatever like it really does not matter it's just my birthday whereas christmas are like the ones where you like spend more money on people and i'm just like so anyways my par my parents got me these i was like when i opened them i was like i had no idea i did not think they were gonna be freaking vans for my birthday so when i opened them i was like oh my gosh thank you so much to my mom she's like yeah, yeah yeah like for my birthday she's like yeah why is that weird? I'm like, I don't know. Like, it's, my, it's just my birthday. You don't have to get me these. So anyway, she got me these yellow bands. And I literally love these shoes so much. I wear them so much. I feel like these are, like, some of my most worn bands. Because you guys know yellow is my favorite color. So any outfit that these, like, would go with and match with, I tend to choose these just because I love them. And I think they're so cute. And, yeah, I just love them. So I got these for my birthday last year. And I love them. Because, like, obviously I have so many. As you guys can see, I have a lot of pairs of bands. So honestly, like I like I said, I include them. I don't just choose to wear my white ones because like oh they just match with me. Like if I have a chance to wear one of these colors, 
I wear them or like I pick out like if I want to wear my yellow shoes today I'll pick an outfit to match my yellow shoes you know so like this outfit for example I've worn my yellow shoes with very often because like the thing I love it so I'll either wear my white ones or my yellow ones with this but yeah I love these shoes and I wear them very often and now these shoes I got for Christmas freshman year for my grandparents um, I was very I wanted these shoes really bad and so my, parents, my grandparents got them for me, like I said, and I was just like, ah. Uh, these ones are the old school, um, I don't know what they're considered, but it's the old school style. But they've got the round laces, which I just absolutely loved. And I love, like, this whole, like, multicolor thing, which you couldn't see. There's red right there under the laces. And then there's the green and the yellow and the blue. So I just, like, I love these shoes. I feel like they're so, like, retro and, like, old school type of vibes. And, like, I just love them. And I haven't worn these as much as you can tell probably they look newer just because the fact they don't match with everything but like I said there's also been times where like I'm just wearing like a gray sweater so these would match or my yellow ones and I've chose the yellow ones just because I love the yellow ones so much it's like my favorite color and a lot so but I do actually really love these shoes too I think they're super cool and um yeah so I got these Christmas of freshman year so yep um and then we're getting to the last few pairs of shoes uh these these shoes I got this summer. I don't really, there was no specific reason why I got them. Um, we had famous footwear gift cards and my brother needed new shoes. Like his shoes were getting too small for him. Because my brother's still growing so he's the one that like doesn't have a collection of shoes because he has to keep buying new ones because of the fact they don't fit him anymore. Whereas mine, I've collected these every time so I wear the same size shoe since all these years. Um, so my brother needed new shoes and I think it was a sale again and we're big about sales so My mom was like, oh if he gets one you get you get a pair for cheaper or whatever So I was like say less because I did want New white shoes because you saw those slip-ons. They were getting a little beat up and even my mom would make comments on them. She's like your shoes. Oh my gosh She's like what happened to your shoes? And I'm just like, okay, okay, no need to call me out So I wanted a pair of white shoes again, but I didn't want to get the same ones So I got fleeced ones and I absolutely love these shoes. I wear them all the time just because they are white and they do match with everything so these will like be the shoes I wear the most I feel like they are starting to get a little dirty but I just got I get compliments a lot like how do you keep your shoes so clean why are they so white and I'm just like mm -mm. I don't know honestly they have definitely got some like dirt and like marks on them for sure but yeah I got these this past summer and I like them a lot I wear them all the time and I just I think they're super like when they're clean they just look super clean they su look super nice so yeah and then this is my last pair of Vans I'm showing you guys. These are the most recent pair of Vans that I've gotten. Again, this is another thing where like, we went to a Vans outlet and my dad needed a pair of shoes and they had like a really good sale going on where it was like buy one get one 50% off on everything in the store. So like, we got a lot that day but like literally we got everything we got for the price of half of it. So like it probably would have been way expensive but like, it got chopped in half with the amount of stuff we got. So my dad got two pairs of shoes. My mom got a pair of shoes. I got a pair of shoes. And then like, I think my dad got a belt and I got some socks. Like it was like a big, big thing, but like way half the price. It was like awesome. But I saw these shoes and I was just like, I mean, if we need an extra pair to go with the sale, cause like I said, my dad picked out two, my mom picked out a pair. And then they were basically like Bryce or Sierra, whoever finds shoes first gets them. So my brother and I were looking in and I was like, I kind of love these because what like these are so cool and so I show my mom like what do you think and she was like if you like them go ahead and I was like okay so I just absolutely love these shoes they're super cool so this is also like my first pair of shoes that are um I think they're considered the authentic style or there's one more I forget what it's called but it's not like the same as all those other ones the laces are like a little different style but I just I love these I'm like these are so cool like, because I feel like Rainbow Tide is kind of my thing. Like, it's just, like, one of my favorite prints and checkered, too. So, I feel like it's just, like, the best of both worlds. And I love these. And I do wear these very frequently. Whenever, like I said, whenever there's a time that they match, why not wear them, you know? So, I have a couple of good shirts that, like, go well with this. And I wear them. Um, and I love them. These are also my first pair of Comfy Kush or Super Kush. Whatever they're called. Comfy Kush. So, they're, like, more padded or whatever. And, um, I don't know. Like, the normal shoes don't bother me. So, I feel like it doesn't make that much of a difference to me. But, yeah, got these, I don't know when, like, September? Like I said, we were just out and about, and they had a really good sale, so I just, I was like, why not? So, yeah, those are my, those are all my vans I just showed you guys. Um, I think I said eight or nine pairs. Yeah, and I literally, like I said, I wear them all, pretty much. Like, the only ones I don't wear are, like, the super beat-up ones, 
like the, the first pair I showed you, I don't wear those anymore. They're kind of just sitting in my closet at this point. Um, the gold ones I don't wear very often. I kind of forgot I had them. Like, I forget I have them sometimes because I have so many of my other colors, like, because I have a shoe, like, hangy rack thingy for all my shoes, and so like, I just, like, layer them. So, like, the gold ones are kind of at the bottom. I kind of forgot about them, but I still wear them. I wear all of them, I guess. And then I did want to include my Crocs in these because these are also shoes that I wear, like, all the time. Um, cause Vans are like literally the only pair of sneakers that I actually wear. If you look at my closet, it's literally just Vans. That's it. I don't have anything else. As, as much as I would like some more, but like Vans is my shoes. That's all I wear. And then I do have two pairs of Crocs and I'm totally, I love Crocs. Like I love Crocs. Because they're so good. I know some people like hate them. You either hate them or you love them. I love them. And I think they're super cute and fun. And I feel like if you're a volleyball player, you love them too. Cause, um, you just wear them at volleyball. But I'll show you guys. This is my first pair. They're definitely very, very dirty. They actually look really... I got cut off. I don't really know why, but it cut me off. But anyways, these are actually kind of really gross and really dirty, but, um, yeah. <laughs> they're the ones I wear the most because they're, they're white, as you can see. And I got these 8th grade? Sometime during 8th grade. And, um, I remember I wanted Crocs so bad, and I was like, oh my god. So I got them, and they're white. Like I said, they're very dirty. But, as you can tell, I have all these cute gibbets, and this is thanks to my boyfriend. So, I had, I've had these Crocs in 8th grade, but I didn't get these gibbets until this past summer, because my boyfriend gave them to me. He had a whole bunch, because him and his sister got a pack together, and so he just gave me all the ones he thought I would like. And he was very correct, they're all things I like, like, uh, Marvel, so I've got Thor, Spider-Man, and Iron Man right there, and then I've got Harry Potter. You can see how dirty they are. <laughs> um, I've tried washing them, they don't really get clean but anyways got a rubber ducky got peppa baymax just because it's cute and um another peppa peace sign because why not it's like my thing and a sunflower because again yellow my thing but yeah so he picked out the jokes for me and i love them and i wear these crocs all the time like i basically wear crocs instead of sandals or instead of flip-flops most of the time so anytime I just need to slide some shoes on, I pick my Crocs, because, like, why wouldn't I? And then, so like I said, I only had those one pair of Crocs for about two years, and I was like, I love Crocs, I'd love to get another pair that's super fun and colorful and stuff. So, knowing me, I got these Rainbow Tie-Dye Crocs, and I literally love them so much. They're so cool looking, they're so pretty, like, I love them. And the only reason why I got these, honestly, is because, like, I wanted more Crocs. I was like, oh, I would totally style, like, I love Crocs, like, I'd totally wear, like, just like my Vans, I'd wear other colored crocs for certain outfits like that's a good thing you know i wear crocs as like shoes sometimes like just, i love them and basically one time i was out shopping with reagan and garen and my mom and my brother and my mom let my brother pick out a hydro flask and she's like it's only fair since i spent this amount of money on bryce for a hydro flask you could pick anything out and i'll pay for it just because i got your brother something i was like Crocs it is. So I was like, let's do it. So I picked out these ones, of course, and I love them. And of course, these don't fit, or these don't match everything. So I can't wear them all the time, like my white ones. But I do wear them very frequently. And I haven't put gibbets on them, because I feel like, I don't know, I feel like it would be hard, to, like the gibbets, I don't know, it's like more distracting, so the color is not just white, whereas these are crazy. But yeah, I love these. And you can definitely tell they're more like newer, because like they're more, they have a more rubbery, like clean. Whereas those ones have definitely gotten beat up a little bit. But yeah, those are all my shoes. I hope you guys enjoyed watching that. I hope you guys like finally like get to see kind of now how like actually like shoes matter to me and like how I love putting incorporating them into outfits and stuff. I do like to post very frequently on my Instagram like my outfit choices and like the fit. I always call it fit. Like this is my fit, you know, like outfit, fit. That's just what I say. So if you guys don't follow me on Instagram, you definitely should because I love posting like fun Instagram posts and like I like to show off my shoes and like you know show off my outfits but uh yeah you should definitely go follow me on Instagram because I do post fun stuff about my outfits and like my shoes and other stuff too so don't worry it's not just like boring you if you like you're not into that stuff but um yeah so I hope you guys enjoyed watching that um just kind of seeing like I said a lot of you guys have asked about it just because of Instagram because I have posted like two of my shoes or whatever and you're just like what's your all, all your shoes you're always talking about your shoes and stuff like what other shoes do you have and so here's the video and I hope you guys enjoyed watching that and it's like fun to see all the different colors and stuff so I literally love every single pair of shoes I showed in this video and I do wear them all and I just I love them <laughs> And that is the end of this video. I did. I do hope you guys enjoyed that. If you did, give it a thumbs up. And if you haven't yet, go subscribe because, um, why not? 
No, I'm just kidding. But um, what I do on my channel, if you're new here, if you're just interested in bands and thought it was cool that I had so many different pairs, um, I do a lot of art stuff like painting and drawing and hopefully there'll be more of that coming soon. I just like I said I've been really busy. Um I do play volleyball so if you're interested in volleyball or sports in general then subscribe. And um I do a lot of talking as you can tell. I'm a very talkative person, especially when it's to a camera. I'm just like in my room alone I'm just talking to you guys, hanging out. Uh and I try to make my channel or my like community, these people, kind of just a fun area where we can all just chill and hang out together, even though it's all online and like I actually don't know any of you guys, but you guys know me and you guys know a lot about me and my life and stuff. So I kinda try to make it a a fun area where we can all just kind of hang out and chill especially my i feel like my social medias are a really good place for that because i can actually like comment back to you guys and interact with you guys more like closely i feel like in comment sections and stuff because i don't have comments on my youtube videos so i feel like my youtube videos are more just for you guys to like be able to watch me and see what's going on with me and it just gives me a, an ex uh, an excuse to just kind of talk and talk to somebody you know so yeah i try to make my whole community and everything just kind of a chill area where everyone's welcome we all could just Hang out and be friends, so go subscribe for your in-depth tip stuff. That's the end of this video. I will see you guys in my next one. Bye! Oof, no. I already said, I said that way too much. Mm. Anyways. <laughs> uh. <laughs> Good one, Sierra. Okay. Alright, now which shoes do we want to show off? Let's do... Ooh, should we like bring up the tie-dye? Mm. We should bring up the tie-dye. Oh, oh. How fun is it? <gasps> I'm so fun, oh my gosh, my shoes are so fun, I love these, okay.